All right, I am here with Kellen, our resident speedster, and he is going to go over some running drills for you guys. So, Kellen, are you excited to do your running drills? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get to it. All right, the first drill Kellen's gonna do is high knees. I'll explain it as he's going. Ready, Kellen, high knees, ready, go. So the point of high knees is to get his feet off the ground, to get his knees above parallel, so his legs above parallel to the ground as fast as he can. Good job, Kellen. <clears throat> Try to keep your arms at 90 degrees, but that was really good. Have you do high knees on the way back, okay? Ready, go. All right, pop your feet off the ground. Slight forward lean, slight forward lean. There you go. Knees up high, knees up high, knees up high, knees up high. All right, that was pretty good, Kellen. All right, so again, on high knees, Kellen's doing a good job for a uh, seven-year-old here. But you're trying to get your feet off the ground as fast as you can. You're not really focused on um, making it from point A to point B as fast as you can. It's just popping your feet off the ground, getting your legs above parallel to the ground, then doing that over and over with a nice tight arm swing and slight forward lean. All right, the next drill is called a bottom kicker. So what Kellen's going to try to do before he gets started here is to pick his knees up, but while he's doing so, kick his bottom with his heels. All right, Kellen, bottom kicker's ready, go. There you go, there you go, that's good, Kellen. Try to get your, your heels to hit your bottom. All right, not bad, it's not bad. So same thing as last time, don't focus so much on getting from point A to point B. Just try to lift your knees off the ground and then get your feet to hit your bottom. Ready? Yeah. Bottom kickers, ready? Go. Feet up, feet up. Keep your arms as tight 90 degrees. There you go. That's not bad. That's not bad. Heels should be hitting the bottom. All right. Good job, Kellen. All right. So just to review, bottom kickers, you're lifting your knees up. Heels of the feet are kicking the bottom. Again, you're not worried about how fast you get from point A to point B, just how fast you're popping your feet off the ground. So the next um, Running drill that Kellen's going to demonstrate is called the power skip. So for power skips, you're trying to drive your knee up and jump as high as you can and go as far as you can on each skip. So you ready, Kellen? It's kind of like, it's basically like high Yeah. All right, power skips. Ready, go. There you go, keep your arms tight. All right, that's pretty good. All right, so this one, you want to alternate. So whenever your right knee is going up, your left arm should be going up. When your left knee is going up, your right arm should be going up. So you go, whoosh, yep. All right, let's go again. Ready, go. There you go. That's nice. Good job, Kellen. Nice high skips. All right. All right, so those are power skips. Again, to review power skip, you're trying to jump as high as you can, as far as you can on, a, on each skip driving your opposite arm and opposite leg up. The size Kellen's gonna do is a backward shuffle. The backward shuffle, you're just trying to pretty much go um, as fast as you can, keeping your feet in front of you. This is good for moving your feet fast. So you ready? Let's line up at the blue bin. He's be going backwards. All right. Backward shuffle, ready, go. There you go, you can try to pump your arms a little bit. <laughs> There you go, yes, good, all right. So going back, this time remember to pump your arms with it. Backward shuffle, ready, backward shuffle. Ready, go. All right, good job. All right, for this next one, you're gonna need daddy, but just to um, reemphasize backward shuffle, you're kind of keeping your feet in front of you, trying to move them as fast as you can, going backwards. Remember to do a little arm swing, arm pump with it. All right, this next drill is the resistance band pull. And as you can tell, it's gonna take two people. So what you wanna do is have the heavier person in the back, an older brother, older sister, even an adult, uh, holding a resistant, resistance band, uh, wrap the resistance band around uh, the runner's waist. And then you just want them to be driving their legs up and down, moving their feet as fast as they can, not necessarily pulling. Kellen really gets a hold of what we're trying to do at the end right here. See how his arms start moving faster and legs start moving faster? That's the pull we're looking for. Marks, cassette, go. 